Welcome back guys to Global War 1936 and Operation Lone Ranger. This is turn 17 for Japan. Let's get right into some tech rolls here. We're going to go for radar, long range aircraft, and large ship construction. We uh, are not on the board for radar. Long range aircraft, we are at stage 2, and large ship construction, we are also at stage 2. So, let's see what we get here. Oh, uh, we didn't hit on any of them. Failures all across the board. All right. Uh, let's come over here to purchases. So we are going to finish construction, um, combining into two stages, uh, two fleet carriers. We're going to produce two fighters, two tactical bombers, one airborne infantry, and then we're going to start construction at a discount rate, uh, minus one IPP each, stage three uh, for two battleships. All right, combat moves. Uh, we are going to, all right, we're gonna try to take over Calcutta. And um, We're going to start by moving this fleet here into the Bay of Bengal, into I-11. They'll kind of be our amphibious assault uh, task force. Even though yeah, we're not we're actually not going to amphibious assault. Well, actually, yeah, we are. We've got these four guys over here. So they are going to come over, join this fleet. And we'll go ahead and put them here. Oops. They're going to be amphib assaulting. So we'll have a three ships helping out uh, doing shore bombardment one battle cruiser and two heavy cruisers uh, this fighter will also be involved um also this means that calcutta will be surrounded by by sea in i-11 and then we've got to take over benares here to get calcutta fully surrounded <clears throat> so we've got two medium armor Self-propelled artillery, and then all of these guys will blitz from Benares into Calcutta and join that assault as well. Uh, we're going to bring... We're going to bring one infantry into the battle, too. So he'll be at a two. Now, this is a river crossing into Benares from, I guess, Bengal. So... The two medium armor are going to be down to a five for the first round of combat. All right. First strike artillery to three. Oh, we get a hit. Nice. So he loses an infantry straight away. Uh, we have two medium armor at a five. No hits. And then we have an infantry to two. That infantry, I think, is actually boosted to a three because of the artillery. But he misses anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, let's see, the medium armor now go back up to six. He's got one infantry at a four. That's a miss. So we'll go to stage two. A two medium armor at a six. There's the hit that we need. He's got one to four. And he hits. That other one didn't count. <laughs> so we'll lose the infantry. He loses his last infantry, and we take over Benares. That's why I brought that uh, that extra infantry in there, because I didn't want to have to lose one of my um, one of my vehicles. Because they're going to be joining the assault blitzing into Calcutta. All right, so let's start getting all these guys on the board. All of these troops in southern India will join in. And uh, I don't think there's any, yeah, there's no, 
debuffs or anything due to terrain. We're going to boost uh, these two infantry with this paired with this artillery. Uh, we've actually got even more artillery. I think we can actually boost everybody. We have five artillery and five infantry class units, so that will boost the marine and these other two infantry here that are amphib assaulting. We don't take double casualties. Um, we don't take double casualties, but I think the two infantry have to start at a two, and then these two artillery that we brought along, they are not allowed to participate in the first round because they're not on attack naval transports. So they're going to have to chill out. Um for one round, and then we've got two more medium armor along with this fighter. We're going to also bring in a strategic bomber, a medium bomber. So the medium bomber will be here. The strategic bomber gets three dice at a two. For carpet bombing. Um, let's see what else. Oh yeah, we got these planes over here in Mastrasta, so they are gonna also join in. Two fighters and two tacticals. Um, and then of course he's got a lot of infantry. They are actually gonna be. He's got a fortification, so to start out with. He will be defending at a five. Because the city is surrounded, he gets minus one. Otherwise, he'd be defending in the first round of combat at a six. And then after the first round, he will be down to a three because of surrounded city. He's got uh, some AA artillery. One, two, three, four... Five, six. Yeah, so he can fire all six shots at our planes because we have six planes. And then he's got uh, artillery that's going to be at a two. All right. I think that's everybody. Oh, yeah, we get the fortification at a five. First strike. So he's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven dice that he can roll for first strike. We have one, two, three. So let's go ahead and do our three. Three first strikes at a three. That's one hit. Oh man, I forgot to do my, my short bombardment. Okay, so we got two heavy cruisers at a two. Oh, we get a hit, nice. And then we have one battle cruiser at a three. Oh, another hit, nice. Okay, so he's gotta lose the short bombardment, he's got to lose straight away. So, um, because that phase happens before the artillery first strike happens. So he is going to lose two artillery. Hmm. Yeah, he'll lose two artillery. Okay. Now we get to do his first strike. So he's get he's got two. For the fortification at a five. A little bit cocked, but not bad, so we'll count it. So that counts as a hit. And then he's got uh, three artillery first strikes at a two. All misses. Okay, so we will lose an infantry from that. And he will lose an artillery from the artillery first strike from him. Okay, so uh, let's go to the uh, medium bomber that's at a seven. That's a miss, and we get two tacticals at a seven. Oh, we get a first strike, or we get a uh, target select and then a regular hit. All right, two fighters at a six. There's a hit. And then we get 
five medium armor at a six. Wow, every single one of them missed. Man. Uh, we get three infantry class units here at a three. They're boosted by the artillery. All misses. Uh, and then we get an infantry at a two. That's a miss. And then we get three dice for our copper bombing at a two. And those are all misses as well. All right. Um, man, that's not many hits. It's pretty garbage. Whew. We got to take this in three rounds, remember, guys. So, because it's a city. All right. He has... Um, the artillery have already gone. The fortifications already gone. So he's got two, four, six, eight, ten defenders at a five. All right. So this should be ten. All at a five. All of that. He only got one hit. Oh, oh man, that's a. That's as bad as the uh, Japanese roll. All right, and then he's got uh, six dice for the AA guns. Now, they only can target aircraft, and this is going to be at a three or less. Oops. Oh, man. we got to roll for this one because it fell off the board. That's a miss. All right, so we got to lose three aircraft. And I destroyed some units here. Uh, I think that guy was there. Okay. So, um, we're going to lose a strategic bomber and the two fighters. And then we have to account for one of the hits there, so we'll lose another infantry. And then he will lose um, – do the AA guns get to shoot again, or are they pretty much done? I'm look and see how that works. Um, I think I just saw it. Here we go. Anti-aircraft. Right. Yeah, only participate in the first round of combat. So... All right. Um, so because of that, we're going to lose both AA guns and then one artillery. All right. On to stage two. Now... We can bring these other artillery in. They're not, they don't get the first strike ability. So we've got a medium bomber at a seven. Oh wait, one of those was a um, target select. So instead of, one of those was a uh, target select. So instead of the artillery, we're actually gonna pick an infantry to lose. Um, and then all of these guys are now down to a three. Okay. Um, so that's for the medium bomber. That's a hit at a six. Two tactical bombers at a seven. That's another uh, target select. Now we have... Five medium armor at a six. There's one hit. Two hits, three hits. And then we have five artillery class units at a three. Ooh, nice. Three hits. This round is much better. And then we have um, three infantry class units at a three. No hits there. 
Okay. So he has a two, four, six, eight, nine. He gets nine infantry at a three. Five, six, eight, eight, nine. Yep. Wow, only one hit out of all that. Now that's not good. All right, and then he's got two artillery at a two. And he gets a hit from that. All right, so we will lose an artillery and um, an infantry. And then he will have to lose one, two. He gets a target select, so he'll lose one infantry. And then they, he'll lose one, two of the artillery. And then one, two, three, four, five infantry have to go. All right. So that leaves him with three infantry. All right, this is the final round of combat. So we've got to win it here. All right, medium bomber at a seven. That's a miss. Two tacticals at a seven. And there's one hit. We get um, five medium armor at a six. And that's all the hits that we need. And then he'll get uh, three dice at a three. And he gets a hit. We will lose a self-propelled artillery. And then he is toast. All right, so Calcutta falls to Japan, and that is considered a capital city, which will influence the role for the end of the game. Um, at the end of the USA turn. All right, so. Let's actually use this unit card here to place all these guys. Get a round bill. Calcutta's worth three. Uh, these planes will go back to Maestrasta. Three self propelled artillery and marine and an infantry. All right. Delhi is also surrounded, and they only have one colonial infantry, so we're just going to go ahead and send in the marines. Uh, they'll be at a two. Both of them will be. And then he will be defending at a three. All right, so we get four Marines at a two. We get a hit. And then he gets a defense one at a three. And that's a miss. All right, so we take over Delhi. That's worth one. So that's a total of four. So, oof. How does Far East Command have one left? Casimir's not worth anything. Am I missing something? Sri Lanka's not worth anything. Andaman Islands aren't worth anything. Maluku Islands aren't worth anything. Hmm. Interesting. He should be at zero. We go up four, so we are now at 62. 
just ahead of the Americans. Man, I don't know. I'm not sure. I must have missed something because I'm not seeing. Oh, this is Anzac territory down here. So Anzac should be at a four, which they are. So that's correct. But, um, oh, Benares. That's what it was. Okay, so we're actually up to five. So Japan's up to 63. All right. That had me confused there for a second. All right, so everything is good now. Um, I don't think we have any more combat moves. Um, these naval transports here are going to go... One, two. They're going to start heading back to Japan. Um, along with these naval transports as well. Just to go get some more units. And they can move three. So they can go one, two, three. Oh, yeah. We got to... Take down that for Calcutta is ours now. Man. So the end game die roll as it stands now will be at a three or less at the end of the U.S. turn. Unless if somehow the Allies can retake Calcutta or they can take Paris, which... I don't see that happening. Um, let's see other non-combat moves. Let's bring this attack naval transport out of port to New Britain and bring him down one, two, three. Drop these guys off in New South Wales and we'll just chip it out. Um, let's get two. So I believe it's going to be five Marines in New South Wales now. <clears throat> oh, we forgot to roll for the rating stuff. We need to remember to do that. Um, one. Yes. So we're going to take two attack naval transports here in P-15. They're going to pick up two Marines, two self-propelled artillery. And they're going to come down. They have a movement of three. So they're going to come down, uh, let's see, one, two, three into P-44. Okay, these other two tech naval transports will stay in P-15. Um, this guy will stay in P-16. All right. Let's uh, do some convoy rating that we forgot to do. So that seaplane will come out on map. Let's roll for him first. So he's going to be at a plus one, but the British will defend at a plus three. So four, two, five. No luck there. Uh, the fleet submarine, let's try for that. This time it's going to be uh, three to, uh, two to three in favor of the Commonwealth. Oh, we got an eight to a seven, so we did one point of damage. All right, so let's go ahead and mark that. 
And then uh, we got two coastal submarines there in I-12. And they are going to be at a 1 to 3 ratio. So 5 to 5. No luck there. And then 4 to 5. No luck there. All right. Um, uh, let's see. This guy comes off map, goes back into Borneo. Oh, yeah, we got to move the strategic bomber here from Kyushu, and he's going to move one, two, three, four, five, six into New Guinea. Where that, uh, air, that newly constructed airfield is. And... I do believe that will do it. All right. Let's place some units. Uh, one airborne will go into Siam, where this air transport is. Two carriers will be deployed in P-16. Along with two fighters... And two tactical bombers. And that is all for unit deployment. All right, so let's collect some income. So let's see. Yeah, we don't have a Y, so we don't get to, we don't get uh, anything for that. Um, so 17 bonus, base of 63. So I think that's going to be 80. Yeah, I think that's 80. Plus 10 is 73. Plus 7 is 80. 40, 50, 60. Seventy, eighty. Double count that. There's sixty, seventy, eighty. All right. So we got eighty for next turn. Um, let's see. Make sure the strategic objective is up to date. I think it is. Yeah. So let's count them and see where we're at. I thought the axis is way ahead. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Just in Victory Cities alone. Um, eight, nine. That's worth two. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Common turn has four. Allies have one, two, three. Wow, the allies are actually losing. That's crazy. The Americans are just one away from getting American technological supremacy, so that would tie them with the common turn, but. I. I don't know if there's any way that the Allies or Common Turn can come back. I think it's pretty much game over, but we're going to keep playing until uh, the die roll ends the game. So thanks so much for watching. Uh, next up will be the Commonwealth and Free France for turn 17. And until then, take it easy. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.